Recent research from the UK and the USA has shown that severe illness and hospital admission are more common in pregnant women who catch coronavirus compared to non-pregnant women who catch coronavirus. This is especially the case in mums in their third trimester. But I'm young, fit and healthy, so the overall risk to me is still very small, isn't it? Age is definitely on your side because you're under 35, but it's important to think about baby now too. The research is showing that stillbirth is twice as likely in pregnant women who catch coronavirus compared to those that don't, and their baby is twice as likely to be born prematurely, which can affect their health long term as well. It's horrible, but we have seen it happen in Wales, mainly in unvaccinated women. Research involving more than 40,000 pregnant women shows that having the vaccine does not increase the risk of miscarriage, stillbirth or preterm birth. Really? And pregnant women with underlying health conditions are at an even higher risk of severe illness. But thankfully, you seem to be OK. No ongoing health conditions? No, nothing like that. That's good. I know it's unpleasant to think about, but it's important your decision is based on the correct information. But couldn't I still get coronavirus after being vaccinated? That's what happened to my cousin. He, he was double jabbed and he still got it. It's possible. Nothing is 100%. But the vaccine can stop you having a more severe form of the disease and it makes it harder to pass the virus on. That's why the more people that have it, the better. At the end of the day, we know that vaccination is effective in preventing serious infection and that's the same in pregnancy. The risks we're talking about are generally quite small, but the way I see it is it's safer to have the vaccine than not to have it.